Let's go to the town. Let's see where the story takes us. Resting or someone else attacks. I don't try to disagree, but if you ask for my opinion, it's better to be. Ah, oh, fine. We'll keep our guards up. Our last hotel. One of us should keep watch. Uh, keep watch? Are we space cowboys now? I guess this is the cosmic wild west. <laughs> oh, keep watch then. You seem pretty exhausted. I'll keep watch. Branya, did you finish talking to Oleg? Hope he didn't. Not really. Though it wasn't the friendliest conversation, I've come to know a great deal in a short time. Doubt I'll be able to fall asleep tonight. I doubt I'll be able to sleep either. Not that I don't trust you. It's just you're a Silver Mane Guard officer in the underground. I wouldn't be surprised if there are. The Silvermane guards have a lot to make a If someone had made a stand in the outset and explained the consequences to Madame Kokolia, you don't need to worry about me. Oleg guaranteed that I wouldn't be harmed. He seemed like a. Rest. Point of it all. Silence. She is my daughter, my only soulless thing. How could you begin to fathom? You will never understand. Never. Voice. Who goes there? Show yourself. Oh, it's you. Don't sneak up behind me next time. <laughs> Actually, seeing as there's no one red, is Stellaron you speak of. If you were to find it, how sure are you that you could stop the eternal fruits? I see. Well, thank you for being sincere. In itself, it's a comfort to me. You know, it was difficult for me to believe you. Some of the words you use are too alien for those that have lived their entire life in Belabov. As far as I was concerned, Madame Kokolia's order to arrest you sounded reasonable. But why didn't she issue it straight away? She must have realized something about you. Something I haven't yet... What must have transpired to cause her such a drastic change? Ah, still, orders are orders. 
It's not for soldiers to question their superiors. I don't need you to absolve me. The truth is, I didn't have every confidence that I was doing the right thing. But the sense of... In the past, overworld soldiers on the front line would lose their lives in droves. And yet, nevertheless, that was her reason for deploying all the Silvermane guards to the front line. The transport line for supplies in Geomarov remained open. But the passage between the surface and the underground ceased. I never thought that the underworld would sink into such ruin without the Silvermane guards. Perhaps Mother was wrong, but how can I change her mind? I've tried, but she won't listen. I don't know how to get through to her. Help me change the mind of the Madam Guardian? <laughs> Not easy. Ugh. The more I think about it, the more disoriented I get. Which in turn makes me think about it even more. I just want a better life for the people of Bellabal. Maybe you're right. Or not. Walk with me. Let's forget our problems for a while. All right, I'm walking. take one through such a strange place with someone I'd only just gotten to know. It's so quiet here. I'm not used to it. Ah, uh, quieter things are around you. The louder they- I'm surprised the vagrants in the Great Mine go after the mining teams. They must be desperate. Still? Can you last with your current supplies? Is that Zila? Let's go take a look. I know. I'll go to Rivet Town and bring them back for you. It's too dangerous to go alone. Get Oleg. The rest of Wildfire has barely gotten any sleep the last few days. They should rest. Besides, didn't you say some of the miners were gravely injured? you supposed to be sleeping? Up to no good, perhaps? We're just having a walk. Neither of us could sleep. You can rescind your bait. <laughs> Easy, Zila. Maybe they can help. <laughs> Here's the situation. The clinic is packed full of people injured in the mines incident. Since you helped us resolve things, as you know, the underground is lacking resources to begin with. Add on the sudden nature of the incident, and it's no surprise that the clinic is almost out of medical. <sighs> the situation in other towns as the Fragmentum spreads underground. More monsters go roaming around and causing trouble for all the towns. The town's resources have been swallowed up by the Fragmentum. To get anything now, people have to risk their- Easy now, Zila. <laughs> Zila and I actually aren't from here. We both come from an industrial town to the north. A few years ago, the Fragmentum began to seep into the town center. I used to manage an orphanage and clinic there. But after the Fragmentum corroded the area, I had no choice but to move here to Boulder Town. After all, I have to survive myself if I want to save more people. Go to a corroded town to collect some useful resources? I'm in. You want to come as well? But you look quite tired. Hold up. I never said you could join us. People's lives are at stake. Why wouldn't you want another person to help? Besides, I have some experience. Well, Zila's lack of outright rejection means she approves of you. <laughs> With you all accompanying her, my mind will be more at ease. 
Come, let me give you a list of The place you're going to is called Rivet Town. Follow the path through the mountains to the north for a bit, and you'll arrive there. <sighs> let me think. Uh, I'm almost out of metal plate. Oh, also rubbing alcohol. I kept a bunch at the orphanage, since the kids often... <laughs> Lastly, painkillers. There should be a bunch stored in the old lab. Hopefully. These should be enough to get by for a bit longer. Metal plates and bandages, rubbing alcohol. Let's go. If we leave now, we can still make it back before sundown. When it comes to helping injured people groaning. If we hadn't happened to be passing by, let's go. Were you really help. planning on going into the fragmentum alone? Of course. What's all the fuss about? We've done that loads of times. So reckless. According to the rules of the Silvermane Guards, any expedition into the Fragmentum must have a squad of at least four members, as well as a communications officer. Really? Exactly. A rule of the Silvermane Guards. Don't... We're here. This is Rivet Town. It looks familiar. Let's go. And watch your step. I haven't been here in a long time. There are probably some monsters around. Way over there. See that house on the after Oleg found me, he sent me there. Natasha said that the house was donated by some rich businessman. Whatever his business I miss huh. What? No, it's just look down there. See the mess that remains of those old stalls? That's Rivet Town's market. Let's keep moving. What I have to go down there. Enemies ahead. Let's get them before they get us. Told you I could fight. Let's go. You couldn't have done it without me. Uh, restaurant? <laughs> the most famous restaurant in town. Natasha would bring the kids who behaved well here for a special meal. So, did she ever bring you? Gotta <laughs> try hard sometimes. Watch this awesome move! Told you I could fight. Right. <laughs> Let's just Make defeat them in one hit with this guy. Reach the end of the story in your own way. Facilities here seem to be in pretty good shape. Not like those of a place that has been abandoned for years. Now that you mention it, it does seem a little... Could people still be living here? Impossible. Bunch of crates piled over there. Maybe we can find it. Get this one first. Told you I could fight. Let's make it quick. You 
couldn't have done it without me. Told you I could fight. <laughs> Here. Let's go. You know who I am. This big diamond. It's all yours. Time to go. Let's make it quick. Over there, the marker. Maybe if I put a healer, I might make it. But still. Speed and basic attack damage. Break effect. Oh, it's 
put one on you. <laughs> She's trying to hit. He's trying to hit her. You can't run. Let's go. Honored to meet me. You? Just in time. Nah, I don't want to use it now. Thanks a lot. Try that again. Do you know who I am? This is Diamond. It's all yours. That'll take more than medicine. Much better. I can keep them alive. That one. Make it quick. And we're gonna win anyway. Naughty child. Hmm. How appropriate. This is our chance. We got down the bus. Okay, let's first look over here. Darn. How could they all be empty? Now even the monsters are gathering supplies? The monsters of the Fragmentum don't need any materials we humans use. And if they did take anything, this place would look much messier. You mean that someone else got here and took everything before us? It's just a guess, but there are also some footprints on the ground here. Mm. 
Let's go then. We need to find... Oh, there's someone there. Eric? Hey, Brat! How did you come here by your seal? Uh, you took the materials and hit. But if we didn't take care of those monsters, what were you planning to do? Who asked you to do anything? I was just about to escape. I didn't need. Still stubborn, huh? Then tell me, how exactly were you gonna get those big metal plates out of here? Want metal plates and gauze bandage? Two hundred. What? Uh, Are you kidding me? You want to negotiate? Not much, but I didn't bring my coin. You're actually planning to give this little crook? No, not this time. Pretending to use your dad again as an excuse. No. Zila, that's enough. It's Eric, right? What? This is a medal given to me by the architects. See that blue stone in the middle? That's a geomero crystal of the highest pure. You need money for your family, right? Take this and show it to a knowledgeable buyer, and they'll. Hey, thank you. But you'll have to promise me one thing. You'll. I then it's a deal. If you go back on your promise, I'm going to bring my Silvermane guards with me and catch you myself. Here, take the metal. Thank you. Uh, you. You guys need to be careful, too. There seems... Oh, right! Uh, the road across from the market is blocked. If you want to go further, you'll have to... Got it. Thanks for... That object was pretty important. Are you sure you're okay? Just... If it will make him change his ways, it's more than... <laughs> what if... From a young age, my mother taught me to be forgiving and to preserve the goodwill in people's hearts. Even if I am but a small glimmer of light in this world, I must try... I must give him a chance, Zila, because other people can't. <sighs> I don't really get what you just said. Eric said that we need to take the shopping street to go any further. Maybe there's a chest, yeah. Oh, shiny! Ooh, sparkly! <sighs> this is the street, all right. The orphanage should be at the end. These shops and signs, I don't really feel like I've seen them before. Let's make it quick. Gotta try hard sometime. Watch this awesome move. Time to go. Let's go. Time to go. Tough luck running into me. You couldn't have done it without. Just... Other... Freeze. 
No, 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 no. Might get pretty done this time. Stay alert. Let's make it quick. Connection lost. Oh, more than that. Stay back, Clark. Eliminating the front. Tough luck running into me. Stay back, Clark. I'm not afraid of you. I want to protect everyone, too. Help me, Mr. Sora. Uh, I should have just, but it doesn't matter. Wait, we can't beat the level twenty nine. Without a healer, at least. Level. 
All right, that didn't work. That didn't work out too well. Tasha and March. And instead of her dash, right? Just a little something. Think nothing. Do you know who I am? This big diamond! It's all yours! That's better. Oh, thanks a lot! Just a little something. Thank you. Make it quick. Oh, gotta be low HP. Hmm. My turn. <laughs> just in just a little something. Thank you. Made 
to be broken. My turn. Let's put it on her. Let's make it quick. Just in just a little something. Let's go. Let's make it quick. Damage. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. Go like this. I need to heal up somewhere. So let's go back for some healing. First of all. What was it? It's in here, of course. Let's make it quick. Tiger Squirrel! Scared yet? <laughs> Tiger Squirrel! Tough luck running into me! How am I gonna get that time back? Let's go. Oh, 
Uh, at least they're attacking him. Is where we were. That's just back there. But I want to heal that one. Let's just stay. Let's heal her first. Keep at it. Keep at it. Locked now. The entrance to the orphanage is up this way. I wonder what the old place is like now. Let's go. Do you know who I am? This big diamond! It's all yours! Let's make it quick. How am I gonna get that time back? Oh, it's just found it. That's it. Almost there. I didn't expect this place to be so well preserved. <sighs> We made it! Hmm. It's been so long. But this place has- Hey! Where are you going? Hey! You don't wanna let me go through there? Okay. These crates have been sitting here for many years, right? Even if they have materials in them, are you sure they are still usable? Do you think undergrounders care about expiration dates? Even having any supplies is a miracle in itself. No. No. Empty. How are they all empty? Who could have... Careful! Enemy behind you! I've only seen this kind of monster. <laughs> I don't care how big. Get alert. Rules are made to be broken. No manners, huh? Who oh, is he? What are you looking at? This big diamond! It's all yours! Let's go. Won't earn you any favors. <laughs> <laughs> what are you looking at? <laughs> Naughty child. Everything is ordained by the so oh, star. Give these trailblazers your blessing. Time for a shot. Hmm. <laughs> Who invited you? 
you. Oh, let's see. <laughs> That'll take more than medicine. <laughs> Okay. Oh, please. Should be all clear. The kids at the orphanage were always getting into scraps when we played out here. If I remember it right, there ought to be some supplies for our cuts and bruises stored in that... I just hope the monster didn't get to them. It wasn't... Huh? This building? This place? What? Come on. The overground and underground have been sealed off from each other for over ten years. It would have been used if... Wait. Unless... Before that... Yes. It's a possibility. That would explain... Come on. I need to look around a bit more before... Investigate. What's up here? Yep. Hmm. <laughs> Teeth mark. Hmm. Ugh, the swing is covered in. Ah, it's who knew swinging could be at the time. I wanted to. So dangerous. <laughs> Everywhere but here. I hope my memory is right. It's great. It's barely damaged. Nat wouldn't have expected. You should still check the expert. Mm, true. Huh? This is. This is. When you were a. Yes. I, I used to live here. Before the architects took me away, be you're an undergrounder? Yes. I'm the successor chosen by the architects. Why? Why didn't I remember this until now? My childhood memories are so blurry. Mother would never do that to me. The architect said that the guardian successor is selected from among all people in Bellabog. The selection process can take a during that time, all children of the appropriate age in both the overworld and the underworld will be tested. In the end, I I must have been chosen from among the children here. The kids at the orphanage are always coming and going. I never thought that there would have been a future su- I don't think she knows. The selection of the successor is done with... And thus... I became the daughter of Madame Cacolia. Every day I see Silvermane guards sacrifice their lives in the Fragmentum. But I've never- The underworld has been struggling, but I never tried to help. 
I didn't even know that it was my own home that had fallen into such a dire state. In the end, I haven't been able to guard anything. Hey, are you done? Huh? I... What? <laughs> what? You thought I should feel sorry for you after your little speech? You can hide in your palace while you fuss over your overworld problems. And on the front line, even if I am but a small glimmer of light in this world, I must try my best to shine brightly for others. Didn't you say that? You're right. Thank you, Sila. Usually when I feel sorry for myself, I am met with gentle consolation. Never has anyone dared to be tough and make me. <laughs> I'm no good at consoling, but I can hit you on the head if... I can tell that you have a big burden to carry. As the successor to the Guardian of Balabog, I must always be vigilant of my behavior. Yeah, yeah, Lady Branya. <laughs> Miss Future Supreme Guardian comes from the same orphanage. How about I show you around the orphanage a bit more? Unlike you, my memory is from when I... Okay. I guess they're friends now.